Hello, my name's Robert Dean Steele, and today I want to share with you a wonderful concept that you need to know, and God wants you to know today and to remember. But before we do anything, let's pray. Father, we thank you today for the wonderful teachings of the Word of God, and thank you for the fact that you are going to strengthen us. And we thank you for this in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, there's a couple of scriptures that I just absolutely love. Isaiah 41 tens, do not fear for I am with you. Do not be dismayed for I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. And then of course, Paul says in Philippians chapter four, verse number 13, that we can do all things through Christ who strengthens us. That little song that we love to sing, you know, Jesus loves me. I am weak but he is strong. When you allow those moments of weakness where you come, you say to the Lord, listen, I just don't have any strength. That's when the Lord promises that he's going to strengthen us. He's going to help us. He's going to uphold us with his righteous right hand. David said, the Lord is my refuge. The Lord is my strength. The Lord is my help. And when you have a relationship with God and you really put your trust in him, when you are in those moments of weakness, that's the moment that you say, Lord, I need your strength today. I just don't have it. And that's when the strength of the Lord really, really comes. And that's when you can do all things, no matter what you face and no matter what task you are facing, you can do it in the strength of the Lord because God promises to give you supernatural ability, supernatural strength, supernatural um, uh, guidance in your life. And isn't it wonderful to know that you're not alone in this journey of life, that you actually have someone walking along with you? I often think of the uh, poem called Footprints in the Sand, where you have this analogy of two individuals walking on the beach. But every once in a while, the uh, two footprints turn into one. And the query was, well, where were you? He says, I was actually carrying you. God is going to carry you through to victory today. And he's going to give you the strength that you need, but you need to ask. James 4, 2 says, you have not because you ask not. So in those moments of weakness, in those moments of anxiety, in those moments of uncertainty, ask the Lord for his strength. Ask the Lord for his help. And his promise is that he will give it to you. A little thought for you today. My name is Robert Dean Steele. Father, today, let us know that we have the strength of the Lord. We have his mighty power, that resurrection power available to us now. And we thank you for it in Jesus' name, amen. Well, if you like what you've been hearing, of course, I encourage you to press the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. My name is Robert Dean Steele. You have yourself a great and godly day.